Well, that's uh, an inaccurate statement because we passed last week uh, a piece of legislation that guarantees $1,000 uh, for those hardworking 160 million Americans out there for 12 months. What the, the Senate passed was a two-month $167. So what we want to make sure is that uh, this goes on for a year and not for two months and that every two months we're going through this uh, uh, game that the Senate keeps doing and we want to make sure that we get this done. It's the same way what we did with the the doctor fix for Medicare. It's a two-year extension now, not a two-month extension, so we can make sure that doctors are paid that see uh, Medicare patients and instead of giving a two-month extension for unemployment insurance, what we did was we gave a 13-month. So, you know, what we want to make sure is we, we do these in the long term, we get it done right, uh, we, there's a, one of the independent groups out there have said that what the Senate passed, especially on the, the tax uh, deduction area, uh, isn't really going to be that workable because it's too short of a time to find out if this is going to work on their side. So, you know, we want to make sure. And the president had called on Congress to pass a one-year extension, and that's exactly what the House did. No, 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 because what, what, what we've done is what they call regular order. Uh, when one house passes a piece of legislation, sends it to the other one, the other one can you know, uh, either concur with it or they can amend it, and that's what the Senate did. They sent that back to the House. We said we want a conference committee. And so what we're asking now is that uh, the House is already appointed on the Republican side. It's conferees. So you know, we'll be back here next week. We're just waiting for the Senate. Well, you know, under the House rules, a member can ask for what they call a privilege re resolution, and that's what that member did. And so, you know, instead of maybe putting that off to another date, uh, you know, they wanted to press it at this time. Uh, you know, in my opinion, what we wanted to get done today was making sure that we got this, this back to the Senate so that they can now appoint their conferees so we can get this done because, you know, on the Republican side of the House, we're all ready to come back here. Uh, as I said, the, the conferees are now appointed. Uh, the leadership's ready to go, and what we need now is the Senate to act so we can come back here and get this thing done next week. Well, you know, the American people need to contact their United States senators and say that they've got to appoint their conferees so that we can sit down. And again, this is the, what they call regular order. Uh, it's Civics 101, uh, things that we learned in high school. Uh, again, when one house passes, sends it to the other one, there's an objection. It, what we end up doing is a conference committee. And for the Senate to say they're not going to do a conference committee, that's not the way that, you know, the, the regular order works. We're, we need to have them appoint their people so we can sit down and get this thing ironed out so the American people don't lose that uh, tax uh, deduction. Well, good, you know, good Lord willing that uh, the folks over in the Senate get back here because, again, you know, the House was in session uh, yesterday and today. And as I said, uh, our conferees are appointed, so we're ready to go. Thanks very much.